Once again, doing free code camp, backend development and APIs in the managing packages with the NPM course. And we are in challenge nine, where we're going to use the caret character to use the latest minor version of a dependency. So uh, in the previous two lessons, we learned about the tilde and uh, semantic versioning. And we know that the minor and the patch are always backwards compatible. So all this is basically telling us is that if we use the caret, it will update the minor and the patch. So it'll update these two whenever there is an update automatically. And considering, again, that these are backwards compatible always, meaning it will not break anything uh, if we update these and our code is not updated. It, for these to be updated means our, they have to be compatible with our backwards code. It's only the major, the first one, that would make it incompatible. So the uh, caret character will only update these two, basically meaning our project will never break itself because of a new version. It will just stay up to date uh, for security vulnerabilities and things of that nature. So we do want to do this. And this is, if we go back to our replit, you'll see express does naturally have the caret, meaning it will update these two. Uh, and that is a good practice. So in this challenge, all it's asking us to do is add the caret prefix to the free code camp example. So it'll update any minor release. And again, it will update the patch as well. So we can go in here, remove the tilde and add the caret, which is above the six. So it's shift six and that's the caret character. And now we just stop the project from running, re run the project again, take our live link here. Oh, if I can copy it, copy it, go back to free code camp and paste it in. And that's all we should have to do for this challenge. All right, hope that helped. See you guys in the next one.